I told you that is not a toy. What is it? That's my new trophy. It was Amaru's most treasured possession. He wore it on a string around his neck, close to his heart. But you found a way to steal it. I had to. Do you know what it is? It's a cipher wheel. A coded message. Yes. And if Amaru goes to the trouble of putting a message in code, we have to know what that message is. Let me try. Maybe the code leads to the place of the flooded underworld. In the Mayan Cross, water comes from the south, and south is associated with the color yellow. Road, mountain, sky, east. That seems promising. Lining up the symbols has given me a possible location. Do these mean anything to you? Mountain road, sky road, east mountain? Yes. Amaru and his family lived near the base of the eastern mountain while he was growing up. So he would know the area very well, making it the perfect place for him to hide something important. I'll let you know what I find. I'm looking forward to it. Even if no one else can. Excuse me. Yes? I was wondering, have you lived around here for long? All my life, which makes for a very, very long time. <laughs> then you must have known Amaru when he was younger. Did I know Amaru? <laughs> yes, I certainly did. And that brother of his, too. Amaru was the older one, the quieter, more studious. Both boys had a passion for the unknown, for discovering the world around them. But where Sairi was the explorer, the adventurer, Amaru was the scholar. Together, they were a magnificent team, each one pushing the other to great heights. So they were close. <laughs> Inseparable. All brothers fight from time to time. But these two, they'd settle their disagreements in a matter of minutes, and their bond would be even stronger for it. And as for anyone else, 
<laughs> Nobody was allowed to get close. It was a game to them, keeping secrets only they knew. They had a secret hideaway, a private code, everything. A hideaway? Yes. They got there by climbing. Sorry, it's been ages. Um, what did they call it? The Sky Road? That's it. That's it. The road to the sky. <laughs> I'd like to follow that road. Do you have any guesses as to where it might be? Oh, <laughs> I don't know if you've noticed, but you're at the base of a mountain. Better start climbing. <laughs> Tobo. <tose> la tucultique y patanol canani huelle tal que lo que se va son con pistale gachaj bastin huella yo la la maru pago que yo la le wal wal su kuman si que ya el más ojo tec le cato y la que hop u mis tu pacta lingualic le ola te estabón huelle bastin has canan le wal wolo 
מין ווחלי, צול לגש פוחנילה, נשמע כמו קטיקטי. Yeah. <laughs> 
wonder Amaru had it so well guarded. This is Sairi's tomb. There's an inscription in Latin. I will never hesitate again. I wonder what that means. <sighs> There's also a key. All right, let's try red in the north. Dancing tree, water, nine. It also means many. Hmm, dancing water near many trees. I think I know what fits that description. I wonder where this will lead. Oh, cap. 
progress. And food from Trinity. How did they find this cave? The key fits this chest. Maybe the answers are inside. Sairi. Here is some food to begin distributing to our people. Whatever the secret of this cipher wheel is, mm, impossible. I can't carry any more. <laughs> <laughs> 